Welcome to Church on the Air, Band of Love Ministries International. We continue in our same series, Living in Truth. Proverbs 27, Proverbs 27 says, The just man walketh in his integrity. Honesty and principle, his children are blessed after him. His children are blessed after him. The benefits of working in integrity and honesty is that posterity will continually judge us, faithful, prosperity will continually bless our memory, and our children will be blessed. The goodness of the parents that worked in integrity always have a way of rubbing off on the children children. My mom, the Connex Comfort, that Roshan Obey, have always told us how in those days, water was very, very difficult to come by. Their house was on a highway. When I say highway, that means on a major street to the forest, out to town. Her grandma would always go and fetch water and put and passers by going. Everybody would always had to have water to drink, a refreshment. And her mom would always tell us her grandma would always stand for the truth anytime, any day, anywhere. She began to tell us how she has reaped the benefits of those blessings. We also say the same, that a lot of us are reaping the seeds of goodness, of truth, of kindness sown by our parents before us. My mom, the Connex Comfort, that was Shanope, is a known figure in her world, and everybody was a child to her. So much so that even when she was in her 70th birthday in London, and they said, Mama's children come and dance. When the biological children came out, they said, Why where are you people going? Because the spiritual children are more than the biological children. Truth, translated in integrity, honesty, and good principles, will always yield their dividends. So we want to say here that let us like the psalmist in Psalm 26, 9 to 11. The psalmist in Psalm 26, 9 to 11 say, Gather not my soul with sinners, nor my life with bloody men, in whose hands is mischief, and their right hand is full of bribes. But as for me, I walk in my integrity within me and be merciful to me. When our hands are clean, our hearts are clean, our thoughts are clean. When we walk in truth, we are redeemed, we are blessed, and our prosperity after us are blessed thereby. Are you out there and it has not been easy for you to walk, so walk in integrity, in truth? I want to say that, yes, the world may want us to tell lies, the world may want us to walk in dishonesty, not to speak the truth to ourselves or to others, but at the end of the day, truth will always prevail. So we say here that let's not join the evil doers, but instead let us, like the psalmist say in, in Psalm 26, 11, be merciful to me, be merciful to me, be merciful to me, and remove ways of perverseness, of untruth, of lies from me in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And so, Father, we close with a prayer on this note to say that indeed show us mercy and help us to continually walk in the path of truth in a world that is perverse, in a world that is upside down. Let us be the shining light, the embodiment of your truth always in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
Are you out there and you cannot say the same? Are you out there and you do not know Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior? It is my honor and privilege to introduce Christ Jesus to you. He is the truth. He is the way. He is the life. So I said to him, all you need to do is to say, Lord Jesus, forgive me my sin. Have mercy on me. The minute you say that, that's all your sins are forgiven. To keep yourself in the path of truth, what to, you ought to, and learn what the truth is. And John 8, 36 says, the truth that you know will make you free. This can only be found in the Holy Scriptures. That is not obsolete, but the most important and relevant, relevant book now. Get a copy. Sit down and study. And perhaps you are too busy. You say, I don't have time to sit and read. Then go get the free audio Bible. There's so many online. Look for the good one. Download it. And as you are walking, you are even sleeping. <laughs> you are driving, you are working. Whatever you are doing, you are playing the word. And I assure you that your life can never, will never, never remain the same again. Thank you so very much for listening in. On YouTube, we have over a thousand videos. We are on our 2,000 match. Videos that make sense, that make meaning, that encourage you. Short clips, medium clips, short clips. All to encourage and strengthen your faith in the Lord. You'll find them life-transforming, entertaining, educative, and most informative. On Facebook, we have five vibrant pages. Search the scriptures, nation building, ministers of the truth. When you pray and I pray, there is a God to answer. Like, share, subscribe. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. This continents of favor and of mercy ever live us all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you so very much. <laughs>